What's up guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video guys, this is part 2 of how to record Minecraft for free with no lag, and most importantly, no OBS. You guys requested a part 2 because part 1, 3D gear wasn't working out for some of you, but most of you, it did work out. So if you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, and hit the like button, and let's get started. Some of y'all may have heard of DX Tori, but have y'all really used it? Nah. So guys, the way you install this is you go in the link description below, you click on that download button, and you use whatever software you use to file extract your files, I guess. And ha ha ha, when you extract that, there's a password because people are now using my own link for their own personal uses. So the password for this one is Hukage's. So uh, it's gonna be in the description down below so you can copy and paste that. And it's also gonna be on the screen right here. So when you extract that, there's gonna be three folders. Correction, there's gonna be two folders and the DXTory EXE. So the first thing you do is you install the DXTory EXE. You run everything you want, decide where you wanna install the location, la 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 la, and bam. When you're done with installing DXTory, you click DXTory again to open it up. And when you open it up, is gonna ask you to run the license key. Now the license key is in that same folder you extracted my file in la 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 la. You select the key and then it's gonna tell you registration valid. So when you do that again, you have to open up DXTory again and then bam, you get DXTory. Now, once you do is you wanna close out of DXTory and you wanna run the Lagarith uh, Coda cause you're gonna need that for this video. It's a lossless coda, it makes you record uncompressedly, so your video your video performance doesn't really affect as much as like a compressed file. Past Chidi is gonna tell you what settings to choose. So guys, this is how DX Tori is gonna look for y'all. I hope so. So over here we go to folder settings. Now this I will just enable use default settings and like you won't have this yet, but let's yeah, y'all think will just be empty like this. So what you wanna do is click on plus and select wherever you guys want to you know put your video file so i select my desktop so i select that and here it has zero mb per second so honestly i'll click on this writing speed benchmark and you click on run now what that will do it will just run how many bits per second your specific file location will take up so each Da, 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 per second so that's kind of fast uh, 101 m megabytes per second that's okay by me and then we go here to hotkey now obviously my hotkey is f7 because not much applications use f7 for anything so i keep it at f7 and there's screenshots for f11 but i mostly wouldn't care now video settings okay so movie settings is this is the important part here guys so use the lagarus coda that's why we added lagarus codas into this so you install this once you're done installing dx tori and then when you get lagarus coda you'll see it right here and then when you click on this edit icon you'll see this i say enable multi-threading and the mode is yv12 um rgb I don't know. I don't like the coloring. And then I put the frame per second at 60 FPS because that's what my PC can go about, especially 60 FPS at 720p, which is the scaling right here. At first, you will see percent. Just go to size and you type in 1080p, 1920 by 1080p, or 1280 by 720. So, and keep this format at AVI, okay? And if you guys want to enable your mouse, like seeing your mouse while you're recording, then enable that too as well. So that's actually all. I don't mess with clipping whatsoever. I just mess with all these options and laggers coded here. So if I did go a little bit too fast, multi-threading, YV12, and I click on OK. Then 60 FPS, then AVI, and then size, and type in the size. Bam. Now, all these settings will not apply to each and every one of your PCs. If you go down in the comments and ask me if you Go down in the comments and put your whole computer specs. I'm not answering, bro. Don't go in the comments. Type in, I have an IT with an Intel HD 4000. Will this work? Give it a try. Because I don't have your specs. Okay, over here we have the audio. So over here I'll put whatever is my default audio. I use voice meter. So I put input, which is this right here. The thing about DX Toy, it has multi audio separation which I love so much because I just love separating my audio and my game audio and my 
microphone audio in different tracks so they both won't get edited if i want to mute one i can mute the other which is great i love that and i'll show you guys the footage test of minecraft running at 60 fps at 720p play it You guys do enjoy my Hukage's wallpapers. It's just so little, okay? I'm a Naruto fan. Thank you guys so much for watching. If y'all liked it, please subscribe and hit that like button. And I'll see you dudes in the next video. Don't forget to dream, make, and say peace. Peace.